We've learned more about the three men who police say died of overdoses last night in New Rochelle. CBS 2's Christy Kalishian spoke with family members there who are remembering them. And I say much love to my brother. Three families uniting through grief Sunday evening, releasing balloons, writing their goodbyes, and lighting candles. Alvin Howard remembers his brother, 49 year old Danny Howard. My is my best friend, my little brother, my, my everything. Howard was one of three men who New Rochelle police say died of an overdose Saturday afternoon in the storage room of this apartment building on Fountain Place. They didn't identify the substance. He loved bachata, he loved salsa, but he loved mostly his kids. He, had two, he has two babies, a daughter uh, and a son who he loved more than life itself. Juan Encarnacion's little brother, 42-year-old Carl Encarnacion, also died. The family of the third victim didn't wish for him to be identified. A fourth man with them called 911 disoriented, saying he was possibly overdosing. Dispatchers pinged his location, and first responders found the men. Police say that 911 caller is in critical condition. This ain't like him, and we're just going to remember him as who we know of them. None of the four friends were residents of this building. The storage room that they were found in is easily accessible through this opening that can't be sealed with a door because it would be a fire hazard. I live here for 23 years. I never see anybody in the summer. I hang up in here with my kids and I never see anybody. In there. This is surprising what happened in there. Sadness rocking this neighborhood that calls itself family. But one thing about it is we be strong for each other, we be strong for ourselves, we be strong for them. In New Rochelle, Christy Kalishian, CBS 2 News.